What's going on, guys? It is but DBZ got one, two, three, and we are back with some more Dragon Ball Z Battle Z online multiplayer. And this week, we're going to bring some more Battle Royale. And in this video, as once again, I'll be joined by Mr. Chico, aka John. So, what is going on, sir? I, I, I'm not really looking forward to being. No, I know it's nothing much with you. It's just always this and that. I kick your ass much, at the end man, of the video. Like, why can't you just ever put up a fight? I mean, like, come on! Like, why do you fail me? Why do you fail? Ah, final flash! Oh my God! Look how it's spamming me! All right, but I should tell you who we're fighting. Why is it spamming final go flashes? Go I'm gonna rape No! You. Here we oh, go! John, I was trying with Tad. I got really. Now he's in the spam final flashes. Look, look at Die! You, you didn't save the Die! world. Just... Stop it, John! You couldn't fail at Die! all. <laughs> Alright, John, we gotta kill the whale. We gotta kill the whale. John, we must kill this whale. Slay the beast! Slay the beast! No, we gotta slay him. The Majin Vegeta. We gotta slay the. Oh my god, John. Wait, what such whale? A fool. We gotta slay the beast. See, he's in a final flash. Oh, okay, okay, he is okay, going okay, to okay, final okay. flash. Kill the Majin Vegeta. Oh my god, I died. Because he is just so freaking powerful. Alright, but in this regard, um, Why people are going against our Super Saiyan Goku, Super Saiyan 3 Gotenks, Goten, Android 19, Super Saiyan 2 Goku, Majin Vegeta, and Super Goo Gohan Zord. So let's get started with this match, and in this, and in this video, I'll be um, playing as Cooler in his final form. So, Quaka Ta! But, um, yeah, so what do you want to talk about today? Because so, you bring up the top, you bring up the hot top. We already talked about the universe, huh? Let's talk I, I'm, I wanna talk about, about the hype for this game, but now, universe. when you heard about this game, tell me what you thought. Oh, to me left. <laughs> you were hyped! You were hyped. I, I like to I was hyped, were hyped up. You like, were hyped literally. for this game, that's good. You were really hyped for this game. And now there's only three people in here now. That's sad, no four people. That's sad. That's really sad, but I was hyped for this game too now. Guys. When you saw this game, when a lot of YouTubers said, Oh, Battle Wars, even next Dragon Ball Z game is coming back for PlayStation 3, Xbox 360, and Vita for the first time ever. Now, there was tons of hype for this game. Tons. I mean, everyone's like, this game's gonna be hoping good, because Nanko Banda guys, ever since Battle Wars, they do it with Alton and Kaichi, and... It was so sad! It was so sucky! Oh, oh my god. I'm gonna cry. I cried for that game. I was like, this game is a game that I'm my brother can make. Joey. My cousin can make that game. And that game was total. That game was shit, bro. It was crap. There, no, there, there was no. It was not a unique game. It was nothing. It had nothing going no for it except cause, um, barrel mode. Naruto, we're always talking about Naruto. Well, it was kind of like Naruto. It tried to be like Naruto. Well, I'm not like Naruto game then. Then I don't like No, Naruto I mean the button then. mechanics, Whatever. how they tried to match the, the button mechanics. But for Dragon Ball Z, we expect, for, but for Dragon Ball Z, we expect punching and killing. You don't like Naruto as a character. Game? That's what all these Dragon Ball Z games are meant to be about. It's meant to feel like you are in the show. It's meant to feel like you had to go play as Goku or Vegeta and go throughout the Dragon Ball world. That's how these games are meant to be. It's not meant for me to click like, oh, I should just click Y, then I'll do some pretty awesome moves. But in this game, there is spamming. All I gotta do is click Y, Y, Y. For example, like, here's a first exclusive look on how you kill somebody. Y, Y, Y. Or just gonna do as you, you, hold, um, you stop clicking Y, then you do Y, B, and B, and then you do that, and you kill somebody. Yeah, and then the way you're gonna revive him, nobody's gonna revive him. Nobody's. That that concludes it right there for Battle of Z. Guys. That concludes it. But I'm not gonna ditch out the game because the game was not that bad. It it was not that bad. It wasn't a bad game. If I had to give it a scale out of one out of ten, I would give it a seven because there was a lot of hype for the game for DLC. Why? I mean, Chico, where was the DLC? What was the last DLC we got? But explain to me that one. DLC was the God Goku was in the game. Ah, uh, God Goku. Why? That, that Why do you fear uh, me Naruto sometimes? Goku. <laughs> sometimes Naruto <I> Goku. <laughs> That's so <a> mean! <laughs> That's so mean! Shut the fuck up. But yeah, but there was a whole bunch of hype for this game, but like, then... I don't know, I wasn't expecting... When I first started, I was like this. Fuck yes, this game's gonna be awesome. But then, as time went on, I played the game, I'm like, it's fun. But then a few weeks later, I'm like this. What happened? 
what happened to this game? I mean, if you guys buy this game, which I would totally recommend you do so, it's, a bad, it's not a bad Dragon Ball Z game. I mean, it's a game you can, it's a, it's a game you can sit there and play for possibly two days, and then you'll start to play. Yeah. Cause, yeah. I mean, the game is good. After you beat the story, but there's really not a lot to do, because this game, I must say, guys, has a lot of modders. There are not a lot of legit people on this game anymore. I hate to say it, guys, but there is not a lot of legit people on this game. On a scale from 1 out of 10, there's possibly 3% legit people. 3% guys, everybody in this game more than likely has mods, more than likely has mods, and I know, all, I know a lot of other YouTubers saw that about guys, and even if you play the game, even if you're not a YouTuber and you just play the game offline, you can see that there are so many modders, too many, it's crazy, I didn't expect so many modders in this game, I was not expecting this mod, no, it's Supernova, Supernova, so, let's get a little matchup now, Super Boo Gohan Zord versus Kuo, now, I think Cooler cool, cool was a good character, don't you? I think Cooler in his final form, yeah, he was. I mean, don't even say it. Don't even. Say yeah, it. he is, dude. But you know what's better? Yeah. You know the you, dude. You know the hero from Bad. Know. You know the hero from <laughs> I Dragon Ball. I don't even know his name. Like what's his name? Beat. I don't know. I think he, it's some arcade game. No, in the, Japan. no, the guy yeah, from Dragon Ball. It's some Heroes, arcade game in kid. Japan, and I think it's like. Like, it's like, you can, you see an arcade, like, I think, if I were to ever go to Japan, that would be so awesome. It would be, like, I, Japan is like, you walk, you walk around, and you ask a per, you walk around, and you ask a person, where's the Dragon Ball Z store? No, there's a Dragon Ball Z you store in Japan. Right balls there is day. one. You, you will walk around, and you will see a Dragon Ball Z store. Everybody will know about Dragon Ball Z. Be like, where can I, where can I buy some Dragon Ball Z action figures? And the guy will be like, oh, you just go down the street and take it right. And you're there. And that's bam, Dragon Ball Z. You see posters everywhere. I mean, when Battle of Gods came out, there were so many hype. Dude, they were even at McDonald's action figures. They were McDonald's action figures. They had action figures and everything. Everybody was hyped for that game. It was such a big deal. I mean, now we're English. I mean, now English release. And I must say, the voice actors, they don't look half ass. What do you think? What? What are you saying? Uh, Why? My they actually have good voice actors. I mean, those, they're not the voice actors yeah. from Battle of Z. Those can least are not the same voice actors, but Goku, that's the original Goku, and they're firing a Kamehameha. That was not a half ass thing. It was most certainly not a half ass thing. What? Yeah. Meaning he's like, yes, like, this is a, this okay, is a half ass thing. Okay, what was the half ass thing? Ha Which one was it? Ha Ha. That's like that. That's a half ass, but a real, a, a true Kamehameha. It's Kamehameha. Kamehameha. Like that. That's like wow. It, it, it's just like the, the way he, the way he was saying it shows the expression in his voice. Like, bro, it, like it just shows the expression that he's super serious and he's firing off something sick. It shows the expression in his voice because in a movie, guy, we want like voice actors or like actresses that show, rep, like that gives some vibe into the movie, give us some thrill into it. Be like, oh my god, yes, like in a zombie movie, let's say. Let's say like let's say um there's a whole bunch of gang there's a gang and there's one guy and he's being ready to shoot. You want that vibe being like the the look in his face and like the sound in his voice saying, Man, I'm done for, I'm screwed. You want that kind of vibe that like in movies you want vibes, like for Marvel movies as well. You want the vibe for Godzilla, just like Godzilla. Godzilla Like you want the vibe for him as well, like the vibe be like he's a monster and all that and it's lagging. You want, don't you, it's not true you want that vibe. Like when you see a movie, you want to see a vibe for the, um, for the, um, person who's playing as him, right? You want a vibe of him. You, you want to be like, man, this guy ain't bad. This movie ain't good. Yeah. Cause like, yeah. you want the vibes to the movie. The, the movie, movies are all, yeah. Wow. I need, I'm really thirsty right now. Wow. I'm really thirsty right now. Fun recording fact, guys. Um, just, um, we were all, these episodes are being recorded in one day and I haven't drank anything in an hour. I need myself a drink. I need myself some corn water or some sensu beans. Then I'll be fine. Hey, John, you want to hear an interesting fact? Dra um, a sensu bean can, in a show can last you eight days. If you won't be hungry for what? Ten days? Yeah, I think it was. I think I told you that before. It, it's ten days, guys. It's actually, ten it, days. It, it, it's an interesting fact about Dragon Ball Z. Like, if you eat a sensu bean in real life, you won't be hungry for ten days. Wouldn't that be awesome? You wouldn't have to worry about anything. Like, yeah. That would be... That would be. I know, right? That just is like so a pill. Cool. I would love a sense Just like of medication. Beans, how would you swallow you like, oh. it? Well, how about how about a peanut? Do you eat peanuts? Hey, I don't do you? medication. So um, imagine eating a peanut, but you don't you don't chew on it. You just swallow it. Yeah, I eat peanuts. No way, you chew on it. In the show, they chew on it. Never mind. They chew on it. 
They do chew on it. Okay. They do chew on it indeed. Alright, so let's put Ah I don't know. I'm not going to go hard no like a piece of candy or... I don't know, I can imagine it's like eating a like a Jolly Rancher possibly, I don't know. Maybe. Well, that was a joke. Serious, you don't swallow it, <laughs> that was a joke. Well, anyway, guys, we have just about our last episode here. So I hope you all enjoyed this video. That was have, a joke. Well, as guys, be sure to hit this video up for like and leave your thoughts in the comment section below. Pretty much anything you want to tell us, let me know in the comment section down below. So I hope you all enjoyed, and I'll be seeing each and every one of you next time on Dragon Ball Z Battle of. Say it with me, Z. So until, so until then, guys, take it easy. Peace. See.